It's a big, exciting Materion world. From the cell phones in your hand to the satellites orbiting the Earth, we are all around you. Come inside Materion to meet the people and hear the stories about how we bring it all to life every single day. Join us as we talk to our subject matter experts about topics and trends that are truly changing the world. Hi, my name is Andrew Cohen. I'm the product manager for the Advanced Materials Group that supplies materials to the optics industry. I think that with the challenges of this past year, I'd like to reconnect with the industry by starting with a short discussion of a common topic, namely PVD or physical vapor deposition, and how and where Materon can assist our customers in this space. The photonics industry has been a major driver for technological change in the 21st century in fields as diverse as telecommunications, biosciences, defense, aerospace, and consumer electronics. At the heart of many of the devices are optical components with, co with uh, coatings, which alter the transmission, reflection, and absorption of the surfaces onto which they are deposited. Most of these coatings are achieved by means of a process called physical vapor deposition. Physical vapor deposition describes a variety of vacuum deposition methods which can be used to produce thin films and coatings. The thin film growth is achieved by the condensation of a vapor onto a colder substrate. And to do this, there's a variety of PVD techniques. There's thermal evaporation, electron beam evaporation, and sputtering techniques. Film densities and thicknesses are directly related to the techniques used. I'll give a brief dem uh, d a description of these three types of, of uh, techniques. Thermal evaporation is the technique where your evaporation material is housed in a boat with a high current source applied to that boat. That melts and evaporates the material, which then gets deposited onto the substrate. In e-beam evaporation, your evaporation material is housed in a crucible with an electronic beam diverted by magnets to focus directly into that crucible. This melts the evaporation material, which in turn coats the substrate. And sputtering technique is where electrons are localized in a plasma biomagnetic field. They collide with argon gas atoms, which bombard a target, releasing the atoms of the target, which, are, which is then deposited onto the substrate. The application throughout and price dictate to a large degree which of the PVD techniques are required. The mean free path or line of sight distance from the material to the substrate can play a significant role in design and form response. But it doesn't end there. As demands and performance become more and more stringent, the requirement to minimize coding defects increases. This entails more than just starting with a pure chemical. It requires materials which remain stable and well balanced throughout the deposition process. Most importantly, outgassing and spinning should be minimized and homogeneity maintained as the source depletes. Furthermore, the size range of pieces needs to be carefully controlled to allow the optimum balance between packing density and surface area. Here at Materon, we do not provide the coding tools infrastructure to achieve the necessary PVD film. Rather, we provide the materials or sputtering targets used by our customers in these tools. These materials include fluorides, oxides, and metals, which could be pure or alloys. The materials are supplied in various purities and forms from powders, pieces, pellets, cones, shot, etc. For over half a century, technical experts from Materion have been working with leading manufacturers throughout the world to formulate and supply these critical materials which enable them to achieve optimum performance from their coding processes. Furthermore, our stringent quality control procedures throughout the entire supply chain from raw material to finished item ensures consistent results time after time. And we don't stop there. We offer additional closed loop services like precision parts cleaning, precious metal refine and technical support. I thank you for your time and I hope this video was helpful. For further information, please do not hesitate to contact us. Have a wonderful day and a safe 2021.
Thank you for tuning into this episode. Be sure to follow Materion on our social media channels, as well as visit our website for more information about our innovative material solutions.